Steve, before we go into the niceties, the game itself, how did you look back on that? Yeah. Uh, I, I thought what pleased me the most is we, we tried to play a bit differently, and I thought the players really embraced that. And to come to a game that is as important as this one, and to then have the courage to go and play a little bit differently, try a couple of different things, I think that speaks volumes to the players and their endeavour. You speak about them. There was plenty of moments there in the final stages where 70,000 people are willing them on, but you've been there as well as a player. You're watching 15 guys. They just found a way, and that's something you've asked of them all throughout the season. Oh, absolutely, and, and, and the guys kept at it and kept at it and kept at it. Saracens are such a high quality team um, that we knew that having any chance it would, be, it would go to the very end. And, and it really did. So I'm proud of the players for the way they just kept out. How much does it help having 60 of 70,000 Leicester Tigers fans in the crowd? Well, I think the sport's phenomenal. And, and it's a big, I'll say a big thank you to the supporters. Um, they've been brilliant for this team over the last period of time since, since, uh, since we could have supporters back in the ground and at the, at the matches, the sports have been brilliant. And the other thing, I, 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 hope, they're, I hope they're proud of their team um, and I hope they're happy and enjoying this evening. You might not want to answer it, but you've never said a goal and you never said publicly a goal. Without saying a goal as such, are you ahead of where you thought the team would be? Um, never, not thought about it in that sense. And listen, keep it real simple about what were things we've got to work on, how we've got to get better, and then try and get better. And if we make mistakes, change path quickly. Don't hesitate. Quickly ch change path so that if we, if we need to. Um, and I think so I, I credit Alid Walters is brilliant at, at that and recognising what we're going to do and how we're going to do it and, and, and helping us change if we need to and changing quickly. Finally, you say every week, it's now on to the next one. There is no next one for a little while. Yeah. So what do you guys now go and do? Well, I think everyone's great. <laughs> and enjoy tonight. Then I know a number of players are going to go on international, um, international tours, which I'm delighted for them. And then there's um, the players will be having their, their rest period before we come back in pre-season.